Hey YouTube. So I have a DC cap, an Easy Cap DC60. Sorry, and I was trying to get it to work on Windows 7, but it was having no luck. And I have what people are calling the fake version. Um, the real version it has white on the inside of the USB port thing, but the fake version one guy said has black. He also said that on the fake version you will have the yellow and white RCA cables next to each other. Whereas on the real one, you will have the white and S video cables next to each other. Um, but then another person said, um, he also said that the fake version will be labeled as, on your computer, as SIM grabber device, where the other one will be something else. But another person in the comments said there's no real or fake, it's just that someone is charging more for the same thing, trying to melt your money. So I don't know who's real, but I have what people are calling the fake version. So what I did, I'll have this in the description of the video. I'm sorry if the video already sounds terrible or the video is not good. I'm new to screen capture. But I went to this site and I clicked on EasyCap DC60. Then it took me... Um, well, no, first I went to Downloads. I'm gonna, but I'm gonna put a link straight to the page where you download it, and then I went to DC60. And I think that took me over to here. Um, but then what I did is I downloaded the same grabber device version. Now, when I first plugged the Easy Cap in and it wouldn't install, I was trying other drivers for this; they weren't working. It was labeled as, like, USB-700 something, I don't remember what. But now it's labeled as SIM grabber device, because once I installed this driver right here, and then I click on it, and it's going to take you to AdFly. Don't need to do this, just wait five seconds, and click Skip Add, and it will bring up the thing where you click Save File, Download it, Install it, then plug in your easy cap and it will install perfectly. If this doesn't work, then you have something, another scenario, which I don't know what to do in your case, but I know mine wasn't what the mainstream was telling you to do. But I know it works because it's under here. And another thing too, try this on a tower computer, full desktop. Because when I was first doing this for XP on my mom's laptop, this one here is mine, um, well, I didn't notice that every video I watched, people were doing it on towers and not laptops. My uncle said that laptops can have not as good quality, but I'm going to see what I get. And I do have a desktop I can do this on if I have to. But that is basically what you need to do to get EasyCat working on Windows 7 if what everyone else is saying doesn't work. And, well, it was what this one person was saying. So it worked, but it was a little more difficult to find. So, that's it. Bye.